Hi everyone, my name is Shohina Sultanova. I am from Omaha, Nebraska, USA, and I go to University of Nebraska, Omaha. Yeah, I would say life in Omaha, Nebraska is absolutely amazing. It is so affordable compared to other larger cities in the U.S. Um, it's very culturally rich and diverse. It's very clean, especially this summer. We have a lot of super cool landscapes and museums and parks. And overall, I think it's very friendly and very welcoming because we're in the Midwest and Midwesterners just love people. The well, University of Nebraska Omaha is actually located around Midtown, I would say, just a few miles from downtown. Um, I say it's in the, uh, in the city center and it's very easy to access with public transportation, especially if you're a student. Uh, we have buses all around the city, not all around the city, but around um, the city center that could get you from one place to another, especially if you're trying to go do your grocery shopping at Walmart or Target. They have a bunch of buses that could take you there. I 100% recommend on-campus accommodation just because it's more affordable for international students and um, outside accommodation could be a bit tricky with, you know, the American rules and documents and stuff like that for exchange students. So I say stay on campus and the dorms are amazing in my opinion. You, it, they're all apartment style housing dorms. You get your own room and you have kitchen and you usually have about three roommates. Um, so in total, there are four rooms. I think the University of Nebraska Omaha campus is very similar to Sabanjo University. Um, however, because it's in the city, some things are spread out. Of course, just like any university, we have a sports center, we have wellness centers, we have a gym. Oh, I already said we have a gym um, and pools. We uh, all, we don't have some targets. However, we do have grocery stores that are very nearby, like Walmart and Target, that you can just access and go to with a bus. We also have a library, um, and it, we don't have a cinema that's just by itself, but we do have a small movie theater inside the library that you can utilize. So when you come to the University of Nebraska Omaha, usually you get paired with somebody that could sort of help you out, maneuver your way um, on campus. And for your accommodation as well, you usually have RAs. Um, they stand for resident assistants, and they're there to help you with really anything you need in your dorm. Um, and usually they'll be your first point of contact if you really need anything. And then the city abroad department and everything else that, um, that they have assigned you with. Um, when it comes to clubs and everything like that, UNO is very, very community oriented. Omaha, Nebraska in general is very community oriented because we're in the Midwest. And usually it's very easy to make friends and very easy to join different clubs. We have a lot of cultural clubs because we are such diverse student body. Um, and you'll just have so much fun. And we also have an international student club where you can go meet and meet other international and other people from different countries to, you know, kind of share that experience and have that community. So it's very fun. Um, actually, I didn't have the choice to choose so much university because I applied for the Beatfield ambassadorship program. However, I'm so thankful and grateful to be here. This is an amazing campus and I couldn't imagine myself to be anywhere else. Istanbul is such a vibrant city. And Sabanji itself is just huge and amazing, beautiful, stunning campus with lots of greenery and amazing facilities. So I'm very happy to be here. I say three things. I really love the campus, how beautiful it is. Like I said, it's very green. We have a lot of amenities here, gyms, supermarket, which is huge. And we don't have that um, back at UNO and it's very convenient. Everything is just all around us. They also have a bank for um, people who have Turkish bank accounts. I couldn't utilize it, but I'm sure it's very useful to other students. I really, really like my courses. I love my classes. They're pretty challenging, but I would say they're also very rewarding. And my professors are, are super nice, super high energy. And I learned a ton from them, um, especially um, about the Turkish economy. And I just learned a ton from their perspectives. And I would say, thirdly, the community. It's very community oriented. A lot of students are all together all the time. They do a lot of things together. It's very uh, campus oriented, college life oriented. Um, and it's just an amazing place to be here. It's very easy to make friends and a lot of places to hang out and great coffee shops are right around the corner. You don't have to drive to other coffee shops like you, yeah, like you do sometimes in Omaha, Nebraska. So it's very easy, very accessible and very fun. I think my exchange experience has been just a little bit limited because I came here in the summer and it's been sh such a short amount of time. But in this short amount of time, I have seen and learned really everything about this campus. It's beautiful. It's amazing. The people are so welcoming. 
Um, I love Turkish people. I love Turkish food. I love Turkish breakfast. So it's been amazing to uh, stay here for the summer. I would say my experience in Istanbul, Turkey has been absolutely phenomenal, absolutely amazing, full of rich culture, full of diversity, full of learning and challenges. I'm so glad to be here. If I could describe Istanbul in one word, it would be super vibrant. It's definitely more chaotic and crowded than Omaha, Nebraska, but I've loved every single second of it. I've learned so much. The city is just full of absolutely everything. It's full of culture, full of energy, full of history and um, just richness and vibrant energy overall. Um, there's just so much to do in Istanbul, especially um, in the city center. It's very easy to access um, for the American for the American students. You can just take the shuttle to the metro, take the metro to the Asian side in Katakoy and explore everything in Katakoy and also go to the European side and also do the same. Um, what I love the most about Istanbul is that it's in Europe and it's in Asia. So it's both blend of European culture and um, the Asian culture or like the Middle Eastern culture on the Asian side. Um, so it's been very interesting to experience that. And it's just a beautiful city overall. And I'm so happy to be here. Yes, of course, I've made some Turkish friends and they have taught me a lot of Turkish words. I'm really not good at making sentences, but I can get by with basic uh, words like Merhaba, nasılsın? Merhaba means hello, nasılsın means how are you? And I usually say iyim, which means I'm good. And um, I also know teşekkür ederim, which means thank you so much. And let's see, I know other words as well. Um, Oh, tamam tamam, which means okay. Avet means yes. Yok means no. <laughs> and um, varma, which I learned recently, means do you have. So I usually, when I go to a restaurant, I say, you know, tabuk shish varma, which means do you have tabuk shish, which is a dish that they have here in Turkey. Or I say bitane, which means do you have one of whatever I'm ordering. So I get by and I know some basic words and hopefully I can learn more. But yeah, definitely an amazing culture, an amazing language, a beautiful language. For those students who are thinking of doing exchange at Sabancı University or at, the, or at the University of Nebraska Omaha, I say go do it. They're both just different atmosphere, different environments, and you're going to go so much. You're going to be challenged. You're going to meet new people, different people, be surrounded by a different culture and both vibrant energy, and you're going to learn so much, and you're going to make so many new friends and have a global network and have the best time of your life. I absolutely love Omaha because it's so diverse and we have people from all around the world that live in the city from all different continents from Asia, Africa, Europe, uh, South America especially and that's why it also makes our food atmosphere amazing. We have a lot of different types of food, very, very diverse and we have everything you can think of from Mexican food to different African cuisine to Middle Eastern cuisine to, uh, like I said, South American cuisine, also Asian cuisine. So you can find anything you want in Omaha, Nebraska and it's very diverse um, and it's very culturally rich. So you'll be very, very immersed in different cultures while you're in the United States of America. So looking forward for you guys to coming and experiencing Omaha. Thank you.